Ready, set, go. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Hey Kern County, Megan Pearson, your Director of Countywide Communications, and this week we're actually inside again. Uh, we're in my office hanging out with the K. Uh, you may have noticed last night uh, or earlier this week we unveiled the county's new branding initiative. Uh, that's a partnership with the County of Kern, the City of Bakersfield, the Kern Economic Development Corporation, and the Greater Bakersfield Chamber of Commerce. It's an amazing collaboration and we're really looking forward to where we go with this brand and what it means for economic diversity here in Kern County. The second event in Tehachapi is their sixth annual Grand Fondo, and this is a cycling event. Uh, there's up to 100 miles of cycling and racing. It's a really cool thing. It's too late to register now, but you can certainly go out and support the cyclist, and uh, there's spots along the path that you can cheer for them. It starts at 7 a.m. on Saturday, the 14th. Again, that's up in Tehachapi. If you would like more information, you can get that at tehachapigrandfondo.com. Next, we have two events for Mexican Independence Day. One is in downtown Bakersfield and the other one is in Lamont. The downtown Bakersfield event will happen at the Liberty Bell downtown at 1415 Truxton Avenue. That's on Sunday, September 15th. From 7 to 11, they'll have uh, street fair, food, and music. The Lamont event will happen at the Lamont Park on Sunday, September 15th. From 1 to 9 p.m., there's a parade at 1, the festival is at 2.30 p.m., and they'll have all sorts of uh, music and uh, raffles, all sorts of activities for the family. If you're looking for more information about either of those events, you can get that at the Lamont Chamber of Commerce website or Facebook page or the Hispanic Chamber of Commerce uh, website as well. We also want to make you aware that it is National Recovery Month and our friends and employees over at Behavioral Health and Recovery Services are hosting an open house. It's a treatment provider open house on Friday, September 13th from 8 to 11 a.m. It will be at the American Health Center on South Union Avenue. You'll be able to get information about what our service providers are doing for our community. If you'd like more information, you can visit the website for Behavioral Health and Recovery Services. Again, it's National Recovery Month. It's also National Suicide Prevention Month, and there's more information on their website. Last up, we want to give a shout out to the Varsity Girls Volleyball Team for Fraser Mountain High School. This last week, they won a tournament, and we're super proud of them. So keep it up, ladies. That's this week around the county, and we'll see you next week.